Taurus. Welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. So I'm going to do your weekly general reading for the week of August 27th to September 2nd, 2018. Those of you that have recently subscribed to the channel, thank you guys so very, very much. I truly appreciate every single one of you. You guys are awesome. For you guys, I'm using the Modern Spellcasters. So, Taurus, those of you that have not yet subscribed to the channel, please be sure to click the pink subscribe. Also, click the bell so that you get notified when I post your readings, go live, all that fun stuff. This will be for Taurus, Sun, Moon, and Rising signs. If the reading does not resonate for you, please watch your other signs. Those of you that would like to get a private reading, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, for morning dailies per element they're videoed you guys will love them i promise instant go if you would like a question answered facebook live every monday links to everything that you guys need are right below the video in the description box issue is the Knight of Pentacles reversed. Your foundation is the Queen of Wands reversed. Recent past or a clarifier, the Five of Swords reversed. Crowning you, it's on your mind, the Emperor, Aries, Taurus, male. Moving forward into next week, the Knight of Cups reversed. Not a fan of the Knight of Cups reversed. This person could be a player. Definitely. You know, so singles, please take caution with this. Okay, make sure that they're on the up and up. Emperor, they could be an Aries male. Some of you could be dealing with a fire sign, female, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But unfortunately, the Knight of Cups reversed. Like someone is not being true. Someone is jealous, not true. And it's definitely this fire sign, male, I'm a thinking. You know, I do feel like it is definitely the fire sign male that is probably trying to, to screw up your relationship. If you're the one, I just, I get the feeling that, that some of you are friend zoning people too with the Knight of Pentacles reversed. But you're not doing anything it's almost like you just don't care. I mean, this is your energy. And I feel like this is definitely a couple. A married couple. You know, they, they're both fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sag. They could be trying to get in your way. The Five of Swords in the past Someone did walk away, ending, you know, conflicts, arguments. Or someone did walk all over you, and now they're sorry. But again, you're not doing anything with the Knight of Pentacles reversed, and it's, you know, the central issue. I mean, even in the upright, this is the slowest moving night. 
you know, takes their time, cautious, careful, always successful. You mean, I mean, there's definitely success, success here, Taurus, definitely, but nobody's doing anything this week. It's like, you, you know, you're just hoping that people go away and leave you alone. That's the vibe I'm getting. This could also be work. This could be with your family, friends, someone you're involved with romantically. I do feel like the Sabila is for you guys. Sorry I'm a little bit late with these readings. I'm not late. It is it is Sunday here, but for some of you, it's Monday. Like, I do a lot of outside of events. Like, I get invited, you know, to a lot of outside events. Um, like, all over and where I live. So, it's been one of those weekends. And it's like 4 o'clock in the afternoon here. But I love it, though. So I've been switching up the play. It's just I'm like same as last week. I'm going with what I feel. I have a ton here, but stay till the end because we are pulling. Maybe some of you may have seen them, maybe not. Ethany E T H O N Y. She's on Facebook, Instagram, Etsy, Facebook. She's everywhere. But um, she created it. It is geared more for women. But um, we're going to just use it as a clarifier, advice, see what comes up. One card. Okay, Five of Swords Reverse. Okay, definitely this one. Alright, so jealousy, despair. Someone could have caused a great deal of sadness. Even commotion in your life. And you know, when they've really upset you a great deal, it could have been an Aries or a Taurus male. Like this fire sign, female, or even both of them, Taurus, could have even been both of them. But we're definitely going to look at um, this Queen of wands definitely alright that feels good <laughs> this woman could be wealthy oh she's a horrible person though <gasps> This is a horrible, horrible person. This is a horrible person for you, Taurus. This fire sign female is definitely someone that is nasty, vengeful, trying to cause trouble, disturbance. And I think really they're like trying to appear as if they have money a great life, but in all seriousness, they're up to no good. Definitely. This is like the secret mission guy. And this is like the tower, Disgrazia, in, in, the, in, in tarot. They're definitely in your way, and they're definitely trying to mess with you. Aries, Leo, Sag. Let's see the Emperor... Alright, this card fell on my lap. Oh, the merchant. Okay, if you have an Aries or a Taurus that's trying to negotiate something with you, so if this is work, I just feel like maybe you might be having like even a platonic friend. Hold on, I'm going to take this. Of course, it has to fall on the floor. Oh, the female friend. Or a platonic friend. I said, 
the Knight of Pentacles, you know, upright, river. This is usually someone that is a, is a friend, but maybe not. You know, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, maybe not for all of you. But it is definitely Earth sign. And this can definitely be you. If you're female, for sure. See this Knight of Cups. All right, this one feels good. Okay, the Denari, the safe. I feel like this is someone that is out for your money. Like I think, I think some of you act, like have money. So take caution with that, you know, don't just assume, you know, the Knight of Cups, you know, this would be Prince Charming, you know, very nice person, but don't be so quick to allow this charming person into your life, you know, just because they're charming, make sure they're on the up and up. Someone might be trying to get to you, to help them, maybe come to your home. They may send you a letter to your home. But again, I don't see you doing anything about it. I don't even see you reacting. The Stanza, The Room, Bambino, which is new energy. Some of you definitely have a new beginning here. Some of you have someone that wants a new path, but I feel like you should watch your home. Like, make sure everything is locked up. Someone is confessing something. Sins, problems. It could be someone is putting money away. I almost feel like they're doing it through a child's account, a child's bank account. If that resonates, just make sure, like, you check into shit. Like... It's, it's like they could be putting money into a child's name and it's a disheveling situation. Or you could have a child that is stealing from you financially in some way, shape, or form. Or maybe you're not getting paid enough child support from this Knight of Cups, Scorpio Cancer Pisces, feeling like someone could have put money aside in a child's name as a way to save money in secret. And it looks like someone else knows about this. You know, they, they could have confessed or confided in, in someone, this female fire sign. 
Interesting. And this is like also on a secret mission. The military guy. Tony, this this fire sign. I mean, she's reversed to begin with. She's on a mission. I mean, she acts like she has money. You know, this is like the wheel of fortune, great wealth. But she she's a she's a disaster. She's a this this fire. She's a mess. I mean, she's definitely on a secret mission to screw someone over financially. I would absolutely advise you not to trust anyone this week. I, I mean, really, they're so full of shit. So full of shit. I'm not even kidding, guys. The Five of Swords. All right, these cut. Look at this shit. Unbelievable. But this is the this is like definitely listen to me. Everything and everyone is the male enemy. I'm to listen. Everyone is out for themselves, guys. Like I am so sorry. Like I just feel the need to tell you guys. It, like if this reading resonates for you, absolutely positively listen to me. Check into everything. Especially bank accounts. Some of you might be finding out that someone has been packing away the cash. A lot of it too. Under a child's name. Especially if you have children. Serious. That comes through very strongly. Guys, if it didn't resonate, please watch your other signs. Let me grab you one of these. Amazing, amazing cards. Rose gold card stock on them is amazing. See the rose gold? Absolutely amazing. I'm not getting paid to say any of this, but I'm telling you, this deck really is bad bitches tarot. They're just amazing. Like, really amazing. Like, these will last a very long time. No way, children. I'm telling you guys. You can't make that shit up, Taurus. You cannot make that shit up. Somebody is stashing money away under a child's name. Six cups. That's the child. Others of you, this Knight of Cups, I always see the Knight of Cups as someone coming back from the past. With the love offer, I'm, I'm, I don't, I don't know. I just don't, just take caution. I mean, you do have a new beginning here. You know, maybe this person, I mean, listen, there's room for anybody to change. Anyone, anybody could change. Maybe they have, but just make sure that they're on the up and up. That's my advice. Others of you, you know, you could just be reminiscing this week, thinking about the past, spending time with your children. Your children could be important. Others of you, definitely more towards next week, have someone from the past that absolutely could be coming back, without a doubt. You know, we're still in that shadow, that shadow period, guys, just so FYI. You know, they come in and they blow right out just as fast as they come in. Especially in this deck. Look at You know, in and right down and out. But, you know, for some of you it might work out. Six of Cups and the Knight of Cups. This is definitely a soulmate card for me. Definitely. So, as long as you know, they're on the up and up.
It's all good. All right, Taurus, absolutely love you guys. And we'll see you back here shortly with the week, with the monthlies. Sorry. Have a great day, guys. Love you guys. Take care.